Hey guys, Tyler here, and today I want to talk about post-exercise oxygen consumption. So the question was, how do I design a workout to maximize post-exercise oxygen consumption? So if you're not familiar with post-oxygen <laughs> post exercise consumption, basically what that means is the amount of energy you burn after your workouts via your extended breathing pattern, okay? So that's like um, when we do aerobics, when we do like jogging and stuff, we expect to burn calories during the exercise, but not necessarily after. With post-exercise oxygen consumption, what we're actually doing is burning more calories afterwards. So the best way to go about increasing your post-exercise oxygen consumption is to do high intensity sprints at like nearly 100%, okay? So one of my favorite ways to do this would be hill sprints. So if you go over to a hill, you set up anywhere between 25 and 100 meters. Should take you anywhere between uh, 10 seconds to as much as almost a minute. So that's about a length if you're doing a timer instead. And you go over to that hill and you charge that thing. You run that thing with every single ounce of energy you possibly have for whatever distance you chose to go with. And then you rest about three to five times as long as it took you to run that hill, okay? Three to five times as long. It's important not just to run back down the hill and do it again because then you're not going to maximally boost post-exercise oxygen consumption. Now, if that's your goal, then hit those sprints. And what you'll do is you repeat those sprints, resting for three to five times the amount it took you to do the sprint, until you feel like you've lost a significant amount of speed and power. When that happens, workout's over, go home, and enjoy your post-exercise oxygen consumption being ramped up for up to 72 hours afterwards. So that is literally the easiest way to do it. Find a hill, put your running shoes on, hit that thing really hard, rest three to five times the amount it took you to run that hill, and repeat as many times as you can until you notice a loss of speed and power. And that will jack up your post-exercise oxygen consumption more than almost any other routine out there. So I hope you enjoyed that. Hope that helps you out. If you dig this video, click the like button right there so I can teach more people how to work out and how to live the warrior lifestyle. Thanks for watching.